you know, but Sabrina, I want to ask, uh, ask you about, about the power of the music and why that's such an integral part of clouds. Um, I think music is, is a whole other language and I've always felt that throughout my entire life and it speaks to people in ways and I'm always so amazed by how far music can travel and how much it can communicate that, you know, words can't all the time. Um, I remember reading, I actually remember reading the sides for Clouds for the first time. I was in Canada and I was just like sitting there crying. And then once I listened mm -hmm. to um, Zach and Sammy's album, I I literally was just like, my heart was set on wanting to be a part of telling this story. Obviously like I couldn't make that decision at the end of the day. So thankfully it all worked out. <laughs> um, but, but I think that, you know, the most incredible thing about the story to me was the song, was the fact that the song really just resonated with people all over the world. And the fact that like one person's story became a million people's story. And, you know, and the fact that now we're able to even extend that message further and how also the longevity of a single song can live for years and years and years, and it can transcend time. And that can be something that outlives people. I think that um, Zach, you know, I'm sure he knew what he was doing and how special he was, but like, I think just even seeing what one song of his and the power that it had and held and how much it's still resonating in life today, um, it just shows people like it, it should give people that motivation and that hope um, and inspiration to to want to make the same small steps because they can they can end up making a really big difference in a good way. Um, I think the music was so fun for us to do as well because like it really bonded us together. I know Finn and I like we sang together and it was uh, read and we, we sang clouds and then after that we just we started bonding through music and listening to music and playing music and writing music and um, and yeah I think uh, it, it brings this film to life in a way that couldn't have been possible if, if that song hadn't existed um, and also like Sammy Brown's a killer songwriter so to be able to play hers is an honor in itself. And how does making like uh, a movie like Clouds change you, inspire you, change your perspective. Us feeling like in this industry, maybe we're, we're not saving lives, but then this this kind of a project can really put a lot into perspective and make you realize that, you know, you can save lives in more ways than one. And I think I always remember growing up and watching films and just being in awe and in wonder and, and leaving the theaters feeling like I wanted to do something bigger and I wanted to, to really be able to speak um, to a bigger part of the world and, and share positivity and love and kindness. But like, that's, you know, obviously this movie has that infused into it just from start to finish. Is the ultimate takeaway of clouds. I think just like the biggest emotion that I feel from this movie is love. And, and I think it's, it's, to remember to do everything with love in your life. Obviously everything that they said, but but adding on to that, like it just, Zach, Amy, Sammy, everybody, the whole family, um, when, you, when you meet them and you know them, like they just, that's their spirit. It's just full of love, everything they do, every choice they make. Um, and I think that that's a really important thing to remember. Also, Sammy Brown was a, was a great reminder for me to not take life so seriously and to learn to laugh at things. And, and one of the things I love most about the movie too is, is, is all the really funny moments and all like just the joy and just like the pure, um, you know, moments that obviously we created on, on set, but also that just happened in real life and were inspired by those relationships that they had. Um, I think really appreciate the people that, that stick by you and um, love them with every, everything you have.